Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening. Welcome to Echo Flow Yoga. Uh, again, welcome to San Jose del Pacifico. I've been filming out here for quite a bit, and again, just so grateful to be to be practicing in such beauty. So surrounded by the cloud forest, and just down the way is actually um, El Arbol de la Luna, and it's this beautiful tree that has hanging um, fern that grows very natural here in Mexico that's gray, and it looks like an old, you know, wise woman's hair. So I call it like the abuela, the, the grandmother, the grandmother of los arboles, of the trees. So yeah, I'm gonna film with you guys here, and then I'm gonna go down and meditate at the El Arbol de la Luna, and uh, feeling very grateful for that opportunity. Today's practice is going to be a heated one. So we're getting into uh, the second aspect of Baron Baptiste methodology. So we're in the awakening section and we get into really more of that um, activated practice that really gets the breath moving, the blood boiling and really revitalizes the physical body. Something that happens to so much of us, especially in the Western world, sitting at computers all day or sitting behind our wheels in the car, our joints, you know, lock up and the fascia gets constricted. So this fascial network that exists right underneath the skin really gets bunched and stuck. And the beauty of that is that we can really unstick it. And so when we do practices such as Baron Baptiste, we really get oxygen flow moving. We get blood moving into those areas by moving a little bit quicker, really moving with intentional breath. And with time, if we really stay dedicated to the practice, we can slowly begin to unlock and so if you are someone that is quite sedentary, um, first, just give yourself love and kindness. It's completely okay. We've all been there. And know that if you start to hear pops and little cricks when you're practicing, that's not necessarily bad. It could be stuck adhesions in the fascial network. And so if there's not pain, there's just a bit of discomfort. I encourage you to be curious, follow your curiosity, follow your breath. Even if you get a little bit behind, move at your own pace. I'm always here and just enjoy. Yeah. All right. So we're going to go ahead and start standing at the front of the yoga mat. <clears throat> so as we stand here, ground down, palms beside the body head facing out towards the side room or the mountains in my case. Let's take an inhale, reach the arms up. Exhale, hands to heart. Inhale, reach. And exhale, hands to heart. Inhale, reach. And exhale, hands to heart. We begin our practice with three collective ohms. Inhale to prepare and begin. Om. Om. up and exhale bow down inhale up halfway hands to shins exhale plant the hands step back to a plank position lower to knees and chest hips elevated slide forward onto the belly inhale and exhale press the hips to the heels tuck the toes press back downward facing dog Inhale, reach the right leg up behind you. Exhale, step the right foot through between the hands. Reach the arms up, crescent lunge. Take an inhale. Exhale, open up, warrior two. Inhale, flip the right palm. Exhale, reverse. 
Inhale, warrior two. Exhale, side angle, right elbow on the right thigh, left arm stretching up overhead. Get nice and long through the left side body. Inhale. Exhale, warrior two. Straighten the right leg, bring the left foot in just a bit and stretch the right arm forward, right hand down to the right shin, left arm up. Engage through the core. Take an inhale. And exhale, bend into the right knee, warrior two. Inhale here. Exhale, hands to the earth. Step back to a plank. Lower halfway to chaturanga or to knees and chest. Chaturanga elbows are in by the ribs. Inhale forward to the tops of the feet. Lift the thighs if you're in upward facing dog. Can take cobra as well. And exhale, downward facing dog. Take an inhale, lift the left leg up. Exhale, left foot through. Reach the arms up. High lunge. Take an inhale. Exhale, open up, warrior two. Deep bend in the left knee. Inhale, flip the left palm. Exhale, reverse, left arm overhead, right hand down the back thigh or wrapping around the back. Inhale, warrior two. Exhale, left elbow on the left knee, right arm stretching up overhead, get nice and long through the right side body. Inhale, warrior two. Straighten the left leg, bring the right foot in just a bit. Stretch the left arm forward. Reach the left hand down to the left shin, right arm stretching up. Trikonasana, triangle pose. Inhale, warrior two. And exhale, round around the left foot. Step back to plank, lower to knees and chest or halfway chaturanga. Inhale forward for the back bend of your choice. And exhale, downward facing dog. Slowly walk the feet forward to meet the hands. Take your time. <clears throat> Bring big toes to touch. Inhale, come up halfway. And exhale, fold. Bend the knees, sink the hips, reach the arms up. Ukatasana chair pose. Sink the hips back. And we'll stay in this sequence a little bit longer and add on. Take an inhale. Exhale, hands to heart. Twist to the right, left elbow outside the right knee. Look down at the knees, make sure they're in line here. Keep the belly away from the thigh. Take an inhale. Exhale, look down at the feet. Come onto the left tiptoes and shift the left foot to the back of the mat in this twist here. Inhale, reach the arms up, high lunge. And exhale, bring the right arm back behind you, left arm forward, twisting open, revolving here in your lunge. Bring the right hand to the back of the left thigh, left arm stretching up. Inhale. Exhale, open up, warrior two. Nice and wide, bend into the right knee. And health up the right palm. Exhale, reverse your warrior. Inhale, warrior two. Exhale, right elbow to the right thigh, left arm stretching up and open. Inhale, warrior two. Straighten the right leg, bring the left foot up just a bit. 
Straighten the right arm out, right hand down, left arm up, triangle pose. So we're adding on here. If you have a block, we're coming into half moon soon. So you might want to bring a block right in front of the right foot to the left a little. Slowly bend into the right knee. Bring the right fingertips towards the earth in front of the right foot. Left hip stacks on top of the right. Right hand can stay on a block or begin to float. Half moon here, Ardha Chandrasana. We're balancing on that right foot. And slowly step the left foot back, warrior two. Take an inhale. Exhale, hands to the earth. Step back to a plank. Lower to knees and chest or halfway for chaturanga. Inhale onto the belly or thighs lifted and upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Pause here. Send the left leg up behind you. <clears throat> no, bring the left foot down. <laughs> Slowly walk the feet forward to meet the hands. We're going to come into this the way we came last time. Take an inhale, come up halfway. And exhale, fold. Big toes together. Bend the knees, sink the hips, chair pose. <clears throat> sink the hips. Take an inhale. Exhale, hands to heart. Twist to the left this time. Right elbow outside the left knee. Take another inhale. Exhale, look down at the feet. Come onto the right tiptoes and shift the right foot to the back of the mat. Coming into that low twist. Inhale, reach the arms up, high lunge. And drop the left arm back behind you, right arm forward. Straight line revolving open here. Left hand to the back of the right thigh, right arm stretching up, revolving your lunge. Inhale, open up, warrior two. So building that heat, building that fire, hope you're feeling warm. I'm starting to feel a little bit warmer. Inhale, flip the left palm. Exhale, reverse. Right hand down the back thigh, left arm stretching up and over. Right hand can also go to lower back. Inhale, warrior two. <clears throat> Exhale, left elbow on the left thigh, right arm stretching up overhead. Nice and long through the right side body. Inhale, warrior two. Straighten the left leg. <clears throat> Bring the right foot in just a bit. Lengthen the left arm forward, left hand down to the left shin, right arm stretching up, trikonasana, triangle pose. There's a little bird up in the tree that I'm a bit fascinated by at the moment. Look down at the ground. Left hand travels forward as you bend the left knee. Left fingertips to the earth or block. Stack the right hip on top of the left. Press through the left foot. Balance here. Half moon. So keep that right hip rolling on top of the left. Two more breaths. Take an inhale and exhale, step it back, warrior two, very good. Inhale here. Exhale, hands to the earth, step back to a plank. Lower halfway or to knees and chest. Inhale, back bend of choice. And exhale, downward facing dog. 
slowly walk the feet forward to meet the hands. Take your time. <clears throat> and this time, bring the feet hip width distance apart. Lift the feet and bring the palms underneath the feet. Bend the elbows, let them splay out, fold in. Gorilla pose. <laughs> I love the name of this pose. Might need to bend the knees lightly or a lot. And slowly bring the hands out from underneath the feet. Inhale, come up halfway. And exhale, fold. Inhale, rise to standing. And exhale, hands to heart. Hands alongside the body. So coming into equanimity section of Baron Baptiste methodology where we begin to balance a bit more. Inhale, reach the arms up. Exhale, sweep the right arm underneath the left. Garudasana arms. Bend the knees, sink the hips, wrap the right leg around the left. We come into eagle. So the knees and the elbows are pointed forward. Pull the belly in, elbows in line with shoulders, shoulder blades down the back. Two more breaths here. Slowly unwind, lift the right leg up, arms up. Bring the hands down to the hips and bring the right hand pressing into the right thigh, right thigh pressing into the right hand. <clears throat> so isometric pressure here. Stay with it. Building a little bit of heat, really grounding through that left foot. Take an inhale. Exhale, press the right thigh back. Reach both arms alongside the body. Aeroplane pose, Dakasana. Keep the right hip rolling underneath the body. Balancing here. Take an inhale, slowly lift the chest. Bring the right foot down, arms up. And other side, exhale, left arm underneath the right. Sink the hips, bend the knees. Bring the left leg over the right, sink in. Garudasana, find your focus. Really, really stay with the equal inhalations and exhalations through the nostrils. Relax the muscles in the face. Inhale, unwind, reach the arms up, keep the left knee pulling into the chest. Exhale, hands to the hips. <clears throat> Press the left hand into the left thigh, left thigh into the hand. Chest is open, look forward. Take an inhale. Exhale, send the left leg back behind you, arms alongside the body, aeroplane, Dakasana. Left hip rolling underneath the body. And slowly come back up to standing, left foot down, arms up. And exhale, hands to heart center. Bring the hands alongside the body, coming into Vrchasana, tree pose. And bend the right knee, <clears throat> place the right foot to the inside of the left calf or left thigh. Hands to heart center. Keep the hips square. Find a focal point forward. Can pause here or inhale, reach the arms up. And grow the tree branches. Listen to the breath. Take an inhale. And exhale, hands to heart. Bring the right knee in towards the chest. Set the right foot down. Bend the left knee. Place the left foot to the inside of the right calf. 
right thigh. Hands to heart center, square the hips. And when you're ready again, inhale, peel the chest open, reach the arms up. Take an inhale. And exhale, left knee travels through center, hands to heart, left foot down. So we finalize our practice in standing position here. Take the feet slightly apart, hands alongside the body, shine the chest forward, shut the eyes down. And just taking a moment to really touch in to the solidity beneath the feet, the earth that supports us, no matter if you're in a high rise or standing on the mountain dirt or in your apartment or in your backyard. This wonderful support that exists beneath you is truly what gives us the space for integration, awakening, vitality. Everything a reflection of the supports, the nurturing that Mama Gaia, Pachamama gives us. Bring both hands to the heart, palms on top of each other. Take a deep breath in, deep sigh out. <sighs> Namaste, yogis. Mm. And pat it out. <laughs> Move that energy around the body. Pat out the belly. Pat out the thighs. Pat out the backs of the body. Pat your arms. Mm, the face. Ah. Welcome. Welcome.